It is an autopsy like none other, and it involves mummies. It's happening in Santa Ana. KCAL 9 Orange County reporter Stacy Butler shows you why local doctors got involved in this project. Secrets from the grave. That's what doctors were hoping to find as two mummies were wheeled inside Orange County Global Medical Center under armed guard, 6,000 miles from where they were discovered entombed. I'm very proud and I'm very happy. This is a day Lidko Sakozi has been waiting for. The mummy expert just flew from Hungary, where the mummies were found perfectly preserved in caskets under this church in Vak in 1994. Today she's hoping the first ever CT scan on this 38 year old mother and her one year old son, who likely died of tuberculosis, will finally tell the story of exactly what may have caused their deaths and the deaths of over 250 others also discovered in the same crypt underground. Now uh, we can find answers. How was the life? Uh, why uh, such uh, many children died during early childhood? We know that there were no antibiotics, there were no vaccination. Almost 300 years after Veronica Orlovitz and her son Johan died, today doctors were thrilled to perform their first ever virtual autopsy. Using state of the art 3D CT scan technology on mummies. For anthropologists, it's finally a chance to answer questions this mother and son likely took to the grave. Now, uh, probably we will have answer what happened. The mummies are back on display, and the results of their CT scan will be revealed here at Bowers Museum during the Mummies of the World exhibition that runs until September 5th. That's the latest from Santa Ana, Stacy Butler, KCAL 9 News.